Well, everything must change. Nothing remains the same. Everything in this world is changing at every point in time. When we were born, there was a change. And since then, there are changes in our life. Every day, our body is changing. Things are changing. Environment is changing. Relationships are changing. Health is changing. Your body is changing. Your thoughts are changing. Your habits are changing. Your behaviors are changing. I mean to say that all these things have evolved over time. Hence, it has changed. Well, change is inevitable. Whether or not you like it, things are gonna change. So you need to embrace the change at this point in time when Mars is in the Purva Bhadra Pada Nakshatra. You know, Purva Bhadra Pada Nakshatra belongs to the planet Jupiter. And Mars in the Purva Bhadra Pada Nakshatra means that things are gonna get lucky for you at this point in time. Luck is gonna favor you at this point in time. The change which is coming into your life will be lucky for you, will give you a lot of happiness, joy and bliss in your life. If you were living a monotonous life, then at this point in time, you will see a dramatic, a drastic change for the better at this juncture when Mars is in the Purva Bhadrapada Nakshatra. Well, you'd agree with me that life is either boring or an adventure. So life is gonna become adventurous at this point in time. And most of the time you can't experience adventure in your comfort zone. Well, some things happen to you, but ultimately those things will happen for you. You know, at this point in time, you might feel that the things which are happening to you are not right, are not correct. And you would feel upset about this situation. But later on, because of this same situation, this same circumstances which you will be going through will give you fabulous results in the future, will give you happiness and joy in the future. And as I said that some things happen to you for you, sometimes those things which happen to you happen for you in your life. Sometimes some things happen to you for you, for your benefit, for your good. But you might not realize at this point in time. You might feel that you are becoming uncomfortable in your life. In spite of you having money, you might feel uncomfortable in your life. At this point in time, you might curse your situation. You might curse yourself. You might curse your decisions. But all these bad events, things will turn to good in the future. But later on, you are gonna see the happiness and joy and bliss which this event will give you, which is gonna happen at this point in time when Mars is in the Purva Bhadrapada Nakshatra. Well, what happens around you doesn't matter. What is more important is what happens in you. What happens around you doesn't matter in your life, but what happens in you is important. Whether you react or respond to a situation, that is gonna determine the future of your life. You know, a few months earlier, I met a gentleman and he told me that he has lost his job and that gentleman used to get a handsome salary in that job. He started moaning and groaning about his situation. He started crying about his situation. He came and told me that everything is lost for me. I told him, don't worry, you will get another job. But he said that I may not be able to get this kind of a job once again, this kind of a salary once again. I said, you need to be patient. You need to wait. And trust me on this, when I predicted about him that he'll get a job in the future, a better job in the future, he got that job just recently. And the salary he got was 30% extra than what he was getting earlier. So at that point in time, when he lost his job, he thought the world is over for him. But later on, he got a better job where he's already getting a 30% extra salary than before. So you see some things happen to you and ultimately you'll see that those things happen for you. So you need to remain positive at this point in time. 
you need to embrace the future you need to embrace the unknown at this point in time don't be afraid to take risks at this point in time you know nothing in this world is permanent not even your problems not even your good times not even you so why worry why worry in your life why be anxious in your life why be anxious for nothing in your life because what is supposed to happen will happen you cannot move a twig without the permission of god god is controlling your life god is our puppeteer and we are his puppets you know nothing in this life is good or bad it is our perception about things which makes a situation and event good or bad it's that kind of a situation where one person sees the glass half empty and the other sees the glass half full and you never know that if a good event will lead you to a good fortune or a misfortune or a bad event will lead you to a misfortune or a good fortune a good event can also lead you to a good fortune and a bad event can also lead you to a good fortune let me explain this by telling you all an interesting story you know there was a farmer who lived with his son in a village and he used to take care of his horses every day one day one of his horses ran away from the stable and that evening the farmer's neighbors came around and told him that it is too bad that your horse has run away the farmer said maybe the next day the horse which had run away brought along with him seven more horses seven more wild horses so like always the neighbors came around and told that farmer that you are a very lucky man you have seven more horses in your stable now this is indeed a good thing which has happened to you the farmer replied maybe the very next day the farmer's son tried to tame one of the horses and the farmer's son was thrown away while taming that horse and that farmer's son broke his leg the neighbors came around again in the evening and told that farmer this is indeed a very terrible news your son has hurt his leg is this indeed is a very bad thing which has happened to you the farmer said maybe the fourth day some conscription officers from the army came finding people for the army they wanted some men for the army to fight in the war and just because the farmer's son was injured who had broke his leg the conscription officers did not select the farmer's son the neighbors came around again in that evening and congratulated the farmer that his son was not selected for the army because the farmer's son could have got killed in the war and congratulated that farmer and said that this is indeed a great thing which has happened to you the farmer said maybe so you see nothing is certain in this world nothing a good event can lead you to a misfortune and a bad event can lead you to a good fortune so wherever you are in your life whatever you are doing in your life be grateful where you are and thank god for what you've got your health your eyes your body the the money that house that car practicing an attitude of gratitude will always help you in your life and more importantly at this point in time a bad situation can lead you to a good fortune only if you show an attitude of gratitude at this juncture and learn to adapt to every situation in your life learn to embrace the unknown in your life as i told you that nothing is permanent in this world so even if you face some upheavals at this point in time if you face discomforts at this point in time if you see a change in your life at this point in time embrace it and thank god for what god has given you Well this is all I wanted to tell you all about Mars in the Purva Bhadrapada nakshatra if you want some specific predictions about yourself 
if you want a remedy to your problems if you want a solution to your problems if you want to plan your life through astrology and numerology if you want to live the best version of yourself in this life then you are most welcome to contact me my whatsapp number has been given on this video have a great day and a great life ahead god bless you all jai mata di jai ma kali